Foxconn has not yet decided if it will give Bo Bergdahl as much as $200,000 in back pay for his time in captivity. That's from several defense officials who say it's because Bergdahl could still face a trial for allegedly deserting his platoon. One lawyer says it's still too early to make any calls. Desertion at its core involves an intent to remain away permanently from your duty station. We need to know a good deal more before settling on a particular view of Sergeant Bergdahl's conduct during his captivity. We need to know what the precise conditions were that he was held in. We need to know uh, what, if anything, uh, he was uh, forced to do. So last night, members of Congress were fuming as White House officials told them why they were not notified of the prisoner swap to get Bergdahl. Some lawmakers claim nearly 100 members of the administration knew what was going to happen. The White House says it was less than that, and they were concerned about possible leaks that could ruin the deal.